Hey, Tony here. Today we'll go over all the titles that I picked up during the month of March, so stick around. So today I wanted to take time to go over all of the titles that I picked up during the month of March. It was a slower month, um, but we still got a lot of great releases, some still books, some other exclusives. Um, but if this is your first time visiting my channel, please think about clicking on that subscribe button and hitting that notification bell if you like physical media content. So I'm going to go over all of these week by week. Um, and just go ahead and get started. We have Mayhem, um, the Walmart exclusive 4K still book. I um, really enjoyed that film. We got the Lost Boys um, Walmart exclusive trilogy still book. We got Little Monsters um, Vestron Walmart exclusive still book. We also got Kickboxer, the Walmart exclusive Blu ray still book. We got Shivers Walmart exclusive Blu ray still book. We got the Walmart exclusive VHS triple feature for um, on Blu ray from Shutter. We got Brawl on Cell Block, Brawl in Cell Block 99, 4K Steelbook from Walmart. Prisoners of the Ghost Land, 4K Steelbook from Walmart. And then I got this um, one from the Heart. This right here is a um, 4K release from the UK that I picked up. Okay, I've got The Man Who Shot Liberty Valance, 4K with a slip. And then from Kino Lorber, I got The Lion in Winter, A Fistful of Dynamite, Death Rides a Horse, The Long Riders. I also got The Hitcher um, Blu ray release from Umbrella with a slip. Then I got The Expendables Blu ray collection. Um, this right here has all four films included. And also the Saul 10 film collection set. Really nice sets. Okay, next I got Poor Things, the Blu ray release with the slipcover. Then I got this A24 exclusive. Then we got Disney's Wish on Blu ray with the slip. I got the Aliens 4K with the slip. True Lies and The Abyss. Also, I got Kung Fu Panda on 4K with a slip and Ferrari. And then I got Disney's Wish 4K Steelbook from Walmart. And then I got this um, six part documentary series for Star Wars with a slip. I think that was from Mill Creek. I got Room at the Top Blu ray release from the UK with a slip. Then I got ISS, International Space Station, with a slip. From Kino Lorber, I did get The Whip and the Body. Also got 1% Warrior with a slip. Then the Screen Factory exclusive, uh, Stephen King's The Shining TV miniseries. Then I got the Aquaman 4K still book from Walmart. Then I got Punto Rojo Blu-ray. And I also got Impulse um, with the slip box. And then from Eureka, I got the Bodyguard Kiba um, 1 and 2. I'm not sure if I pronounced that correctly. I also got K19, The Widowmaker from Shout Select 4K release. Um, I got Dark Water, Dark Water from the Arrow exclusive with the slip. And then I got Green Room from Second Sight, Possessor from Second Sight, and then from Kino Lober I got Rent to Cop, Target, Changing Lanes 4K release, The Manchurian Candidate um, 4K release. And then from 88 Films, I got the 88 Film Store exclusive for the Amityville Horror with this nice slip box. And from Screen Factory, I got the Child's Play um, Reboot Collector's Edition 4K release. Also, Carrie 4K release. And I also got from 101 Films, Fear City. And then from Indicator, I got Santo vs. The Riders of Terror. Snapshot, 
the Panther Women, the Batwoman, and Patrick. From King of Lorber, I got Brain Donors. When Evil Lurks with a Slip. Primal Fear 4K from Paramount Presents. The Iron Claw. From Kino Lober, I got Paint Your Wagon. I got Monk. Um, this is Season 5. North Dallas 40. Um, from Screen Factory, I got Venomous. The, um, this is exclusive to their site. And then I got The Crow Salvation, which is also an exclusive from their site. Um, I got Night of the Blood Monster. Wednesday, the um, season one. From 88 Films, I got Witchfinder General with this really nice artwork. And also the Blood on Satan's Claw. From Arrow, I got City of the Living Dead 4K release. From Eureka, I got The Swordsman of All Swordsmen. I believe that's what it's called. And I bought The Greatest Story Ever Told media book. This is a UK release. I didn't have this one in the collection, so I thought the media book release would be a nice addition. Okay, and then I picked up the Emily um, Blu-ray still book, which I need to still watch. From Vinegar Syndrome, I got the Rocket Fire Explosion documentary. Simon Killer. This film right here. Night Siren. Video Headquarters. Man on the Brink. Bubble Bath. The Zombie Army. Where the Devil Roams. Carpet Cowboys. And then from 88 Films, I got The Inspector Wears Skirts Part 2. And so those are all of the pickups that I did during the month of March. Like I said, it was a lighter month. If it wouldn't have been for the Vinegar Syndrome or the Walmart Steel Books, um, I probably would have saved a lot, of a lot of money during the month of March. Um, and hopefully the month of April will be similar because um, it, it's always nice to be able to kind of cut back some. But please leave a comment below. Let me know what you think about the titles that I picked up. And also let me know the titles that you were able to pick up during the month of March because I really do enjoy reading your comments. I appreciate you taking the time to watch this video and we will see you next time.